All right, folks, it's time for game two of Backyard Baseball Season 3. We've got this amazing team this year, a lot of all-stars. I'm really optimistic about our chances. Uh, who are we facing today? Oh, the Cardinals. Interesting. Cardinals are a pretty great bird, after all. Ooh, this is going to be fun. I've, I'm very proud of our team thus far. We clobbered the Pirates last game, 13-4. to that's, that's just a slaughter. All right, let's go to our roster and see what's changed. Oh my gosh, it's Steel Stadium! Yes! Best course! Oh, this is fantastic. I'm, I'm actually really, really psyched for this. All right, let's see our players and what they've got. Tony is feeling good. Dante's feeling good. Stephanie Morgan's feeling good. Arfur is... Ooh. Arfur... Oh, Arfur's going to drop everything today. And he's not going to pull off the big hit, I don't think. Uh-oh. Doggone it, Arthur. <laughs> Pablo's up back to his usual self. Pete Wheeler's good. Lisa's good. Marky's back to normal. And Mikey's good. All right. Hmm. All right, we might have to change up the field. Okay, well, first off, Lisa's obviously going to be our starting pitcher. That's that's a definite. Um. Yep, yep. Arthur don't have his lucky pencil this time. So... I'll keep Stephanie at shortstop, but I mean, honestly, she was kind of disappointing at shortstop last game. I think I'll put Arfur maybe in the outfield, honestly, and just hope they don't hit to the left field. Of course, as soon as I do that, they're going to start hitting to left field, I bet. But that's that's what we're going to do. All right, let's check out their roster, see what's up. Okay, so they have Gail Weinman. She's a pretty solid player. Uh, Ezra Travolta. Uh-oh, she got a couple increases. She looks pretty dangerous. Yikes. Vix... Oh, it's the Souffle! The Souffle has, has returned. Okay, he's fast, but that's about it. I don't have to worry about his batting. Uh, Rosanna Phelps, decent. Kind of fast. That's about it. Ooh, Nate Kowalski is not having a good day. If you thought Arthur had the decreases, look at that. Oh, man. He sucks! <laughs> oh, man, he really sucks. Oh, and he's next to the Souffle as well. Interesting. Ken Griffey Jr. is scary, but less scary today. He's still pretty good at batting, but... Ooh, he got hit hard with the decreases. PJ? Okay, he's, he's pretty... He's like Tony, basically. Mark McGuire? Oh, gotta watch out for him. He's gonna be good. Okay, watch out for the pro players. They're both really good at batting. And then Brett Olson. Okay, well, he's, he's fast. Okay, they, they got a couple good players, and they got a couple bad players. That's good. We'll, we'll work around that. Maybe see if we can get some double plays. Let's begin. Hello, baseball enthusiasts. It's time for another adventurous BBL season of unforgettable plays. Sunny Day here with my pal Vinny the Gooch at Steel Stadium, where a hit in a neighbor's pool is a home run by rule. Today's matchup is between the Green Fishes and the St. Louis Cardinals. Hey kiddos, don't forget to buy your raffle ticket. We've got a humdinger of a grand prize this season. A year supply of bubble gum chew. Just you said this last you. time. You could chew for a whole year without ever stopping. So, what so they just give you one pack of gum. <laughs> ball. Yes sir, these fans are going crazy for the fishes. Let's hear it everybody. <laughs> Well, duh! It's not even our field in there cheering for us. Yep, it's, it looks like the Cardinals have got two pros, and they're both kind of scary. So, we gotta watch out for that. Although, Ken Griffey Jr., I never thought I'd say it, but he's the least, less scary of them all. Hi, Janae! Welcome! Nice to see you. Alright, let's kick out their butts. Okay, let's play ball! The starting pitcher today is... It's, let's just Edgar ignore the Volta. fact that birds eat to fish. Show these batters a thing or two. All right. Oh, Pete, you still got that nice one sweet 1.0 batting average. I hate our team's uniforms though. <laughs> I'm going to hit a touchdown. No, you're not. You're going to bunt. All right. John Travolta's up at the pitcher mound. There's a bunt. You can do it. Oh my gosh, that kid is huge. That's a man. <laughs> He's as tall as Pete and like three times as thick. Munch. Heck yeah. All right, Dante. Got to remember that he's got a little bit of a uh, beginner lag on his bunts. Dante, come on. 
man-child, indeed. Okay. They've got an okay arm at the, at the uh, catcher's plate, so we, we ain't stealing with Marky Dubois today. Nor are we stealing third base. But our fast characters can still steal, steal second, no problem. Alright. Come on, let's bunt this. Thank you. Oh my... Ha! Oh man, the man got knocked out. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be hard to get to first, though. Yeah, you are. I have full faith in you, Mikey. With that nice 1.0 batting average. Oh. Maybe move back, Dante. Alright. Th thus, there goes the 1.0 batting average. It's not even necessarily the yellow that I don't like about the outfits. It's the yellow and the purple together. It doesn't look good. <laughs> You, you know who else likes our team because we're purple? Barney. Barney loves our team. All right, Pablo. Let's get a home run early and get a, an early lead. Ooh, what a nice one. Oh, that's beautiful. Way to go. First point. That's one, one chocolate-covered raisin. Oh, don't worry, our savior is here, folks. Alright, Marky. I'm waiting for it. Just hit it into the outfield for me. Okay, that's not exactly where the outfield is. Okay. Well, at least it wasn't a double play. If they had thrown it to first, it probably would have been a double play. Okay, they've actually got a pretty tight infield. They've got some people with good arms. We're gonna have to rely on some home runs this game, me thinks. Have you ever seen Tony Del Vecchio with that high of a batting average? I know I haven't. Oh. Don't throw it low down. Tony can't hit those. Of course, it was a strike. Nobody better laugh. Ha ha ha! I shouldn't be laughing at my own guy. Whoops. <laughs> That's right. We are the Green Fishes, Marty, and we will defeat them. We will defeat the Cardinals. the heck out of it. Just don't ask her to throw a slow ball. All right, Brett. <laughs> Okay, Brett is not a good batter, but he's fast, so we get... Tony, I'm counting on you to rocket it to Marky. <laughs> Vinny, this is my first pitch of the game. Do you really think I have special pitches? Throw the heat. <laughs> I'm surprised they're having Brett actually try to swing at it and not bunt. All right, just get him out. Come on, get him out. Okay, he's out. Oh, that counts as a strike. Uh, maybe it doesn't, actually. It plays the strikeout theme, but do we get a power-up? Yes, it does. Okay. All right, Travolta. Oh, yes, the big freeze. Not as good against AI as against they are against human players, but still. All right, Pablo, that's all you. Oh, what a beautiful play. Nice job, team. Oh, it's it's the man! Actually, he's not a man, but he is definitely in middle school, about to enter high school. Look at that! <laughs> Compare his size to the size of Lisa. I know, again, forced perspective, so Lisa smaller, looks smaller than she actually is, but still, like, what the heck? This is like Ron Weasley if he started taking roids. I love, I love how they literally just made some of the pros, like, giant. <laughs> oh, that's right! This is the guy that's capped at batting. 
Okay, we got a. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Good. <laughs> Lisa's getting the strikeouts now. <laughs> he does look like one of our friends, doesn't he? Oh yes. Okay. All right, Arthur, we're going to try the line drive today because you're a little worse at batting than you are usually. Luckily, Arthur is still just as fast as he always is. <laughs> Ezra, you're going to have to throw something else. <laughs> That was way too late. I couldn't tell if that was a slow ball or if it was going to curve. It's hard to tell at sometimes. Okay, Arthur, we gotta we gotta pack a little bit more punch into it than that. No, you know what? Let's go power. Let's go power. The line drive ain't giving us enough distance. Full count. Interesting. I know I personally would not walk Arthur. Oh, we actually hit it, even though it was definitely a ball. We should not have hit that. Darn it. Again, I thought that one was going to curve. All right, Stephanie. <laughs> yes, we added new sound alerts. <laughs> Most of them Arthur themed. <laughs> it's perfect for when Arthur does a bad. <laughs> okay. Maybe I should start trying to hit power with Stephanie. Okay, we can beat... No, we can't beat Ron Weasley to the base. Well, that's the inning. <laughs> yes, Marty, new alerts. Our new channel point rewards. There are three or four of them. Let's try power with Lisa. We have literally nothing to lose. Whoa! Oh my gosh, Lisa! <laughs> that was insane! <laughs> Dane! Ch she's channeling the mad part of Mad Dog. Wow! That was... I've never seen Lisa hit the ball that hard. That was fantastic. I'm gonna hit a touchdown. Let's try to hit a touchdown, Pete. One of the new channel point rewards I added was a face reveal. For the low, low price of 2 billion arty bucks, you can have me show my face on stream. Now, if you subscribe with a tier free sub, you can earn double arty bucks, and thus it'll only take you about 450 years of straight watching my content in order to get it. Absolute bargain. Okay. Okay, we advanced! <laughs> nice! <laughs> okay, I added the face reveal, obviously, just for the joke slash meme. Ah! <laughs> Ooh! Let's try that. Line drive with Dante! Oh. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what you guys are worked up about. <laughs> I put my face in my avatar. Ironically, by the time people actually get enough channel points to trigger the face reveal, I'll be a skeleton. Okay, that's a foul. Bam! Dante, come on. Actually, he's only a four at batting, so this is actually completely in character for him. Nah, Marty, if I really wanted to be the sellout, then I would absolutely have... No, no, don't catch it. Darn it. Very true. <laughs> I'm not a sellout until I start putting in subscriber goals. <laughs> Of course, they're all kids here, aren't they? Nobody else. Oh boy, Ken Griffey Jr. He he worries me. He's less scary today, but he's still like a nine at batting. Ooh. 
Okay, Marky. Okay, Marky, that is it. Marky. What the butts was that, Marky? Are you serious? You guys saw that. I was blatantly clicking to it, and he's like, Yuck, I'm going the opposite way, coach. Wow. He totally just... You know what? You know what I think? He knew Ken Griffey Jr. was slow, and so he's trying to get us the double play. He's actually big brain, guys. You're lousy. <laughs> But yeah, that was a lousy thing to do. <laughs> yeah, they just say the same stuff every time. Oh wait, that's not where I wanted to throw it. Maybe it'll be a strike anyway. Okay, sweet! Nice strikeout, Lisa. That was very nicely done. Lisa was mad that I was trash-talking her a bit last game. She's like, I'll show you why you picked me again, coach. Oh no, it's PJ. Pete's son. I thought he was in college with Max and Goofy. Oh boy, we got the crazy ball. Man, we haven't we haven't been getting juice boxes this season. I know it's the, only the second game, but usually the juice box is like the first thing you get. It's also one of the most useful. Oh, nice job, Lisa. We're all watching intently, Lisa. Strike out, PJ. Okay. Well, you know what we can do. Double play. Double play! Oh, this is going to be good. Maybe we'll actually get to use the undergrounder this time. Ooh, crazy bunt! That'll be useful. I really like the crazy bunt. Whoa! Oh, that's up. Into the swimming pool! Mikey Thomas! Goodbye, baseball. They just don't make hitters like that anymore. Vinny, what are you talking about? He's just a kid. That was easy. <laughs> oh, Mikey. Yes. Oh, hey. The don't you believe it didn't actually play. What the heck? All right, back to the game, Pablo. Shukunk. Okay, well that was. Pa get it past those two kids. Uh, uh, run. Darn. And he's out. That kid was out by a mile. He was like one foot away from stepping on base. What are you talking about, Vinny? Yeah, I, I really don't think it is, Marky. <gasps> Please get out. Oh, that's a foul. Darn it. Let's just keep tiring out John Travolta. <laughs> My gosh, Marky. <laughs> Come on, coach. This is strategy right here. <laughs> How many times has he fouled it? <laughs> I'm not using my crazy bunt on Marky. Not when there's nobody on base. Ow. That's okay. We tired her out. <laughs> I want the frog on my team, not just Marky. The frog is clearly a lot stronger. Alright, line drive for the Jedi. Okay, that's an out. Don't even bother running to tell yourself out. That's an out. Can't win a game if you don't get on base. Hey, we're we're two points up. <laughs> All right, we got Kowalski, the Souffle, and then Rosanna Phelps. Okay. Easy out. Actually, th is this the guy who's just really bad at everything? Yeah. Oh yeah. I'm gonna just throw. Actually, should I just walk him? I'll see if I'll let him try to hit it if he wants, but if we get a strikeout, I'll also take that. <laughs> the slow ball is just the regular pitch. It's like the default. Oh, he's not very good. I don't really want to cinch him though. I kind of want him to get a hit. 
Unless, of course, he fouls it. I'm just using slow balls because this doesn't tire Lisa out. Unless he's going to pull the Marky strategy and just keep fouling it. Darn it, he, that's exactly what he's doing. <laughs> this, would, this is kind of a boring game, isn't it? It's just like, let's keep following the ball and eventually the pitcher will get to... Oh! You know, considering... Considering he was... Considering he was like... A two at batting, he actually got a pretty good hit in. Okay, Lisa, face face him, and now catch it. There we go. Alright. The souffle will fall. Although the souffle is pretty fast. But he's not good at batting. Well, yes, batters do have to have eyes, Vinny. It is true. Wink! I wish you could just discard... I wish you could either discard special pitches you don't want, or just hold all the special pitches. Because I don't want to use the slow-mo or the crazy ball, but I want to have room for the other pitches. Alright, nice job. Nice job, Lisa. That's her fourth strikeout of the game. Definitely making up for lost time. Oh, not the sp We have three of the worst pitches. Um, Rosanna, how are you? Oh, okay, she's kind of fast. I'm going to see if she can just get a hit and we can get a double play. That would be great. Okay. Grab it. Oh, man. Well, Dante got it out, but at what cost? <laughs> Dante just got uh, some minor brain damage from that. It literally looked like he caught it with his face. Alright. Oh, it's Brett. I'm not worried about Brett. You think I'm worried about Brett? He's already out. <laughs> it's out of play. Advanced two bases, but it doesn't matter because it's free outs. <laughs> Why do my characters just, like, throw it and then they're like, I'm not catching it? <laughs> Alright, Arthur. Yeah. Yep, fiends are just going swimmingly. Okay, Arthur. I, I want to. Okay. Is that just an out? <laughs> that will never get old. Alright, we're hitting power of Stephanie. I want to see what she can do. Okay. <laughs> it's, it could be hard to tell sometimes with those hooks. Especially since the game registers fiends closer to the strike zone than they actually are. Darn it, I keep hitting it to big... Big Redhead McGee. Alright, well, we're hitting power with Lisa again, because that worked out real well last time. I'm trying to learn which of my characters can use the power and which of them can't. Okay. A little disappointing. Wow. They were just baiting me. They literally gave me false hope just to get me out. Alright. Ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, staying alive, staying alive. Alright, at least we're going back to the strong part of our lineup next, though. I'll throw in the heat to somebody who's skilled at batting is a bad idea. Pablo, are you... S Why do my guys run away from where I click? That's really annoying. There was one thing when Marky did it, because Marky's kind of dumb, but Pablo, really? Alright, Ron Weasley. I'm scared, because he if there's anyone who could get a home run on their team, it's definitely the big guy. <laughs> that was not a strike. <laughs> no, it was not. Cool. Get him out. We struck him out twice. This is fantastic. They have both their pros back-to-back. 
All right, the corkscrew can be all right. We've got one great pitch, one all right pitch, and three, three terrible ones. I want juice. Give me the juice. Give me the, the Capri Suns, the juicy juice. There's nothing more refreshing. Part of me wants to throw a special pitch, but then Lisa would just be totally gassed. And I'm thinking, no. Alright, Ken Griffey Jr., get out. Dang, Lisa is on point with the strikeouts today. My goodness. I don't think she got any last game. Or no, she got one. <laughs> it's because Ken is special, that's why. Sometimes he just can't hang on to that ball. The throw to second. I'm disappointed, Dante. PJ Sharif steps up to bat. I got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> He's like, I think that Artie's in a bit of a mood. <laughs> I don't remember the Rouge the Bat Sonic X music. I remember it from the game, though. The jazzy music. All the pros just have a variety of pro jingles, and that that was one of them. Can't trust Dante for anything. Pete Wheeler still has the 1.0. That's going to change eventually, but let's hope it doesn't change this game. I'm gonna hit a touchdown. Oh, and we still have the crazy bunt, too. That's right. I've just never had people on base to use it. And the offering, the wing. Hmm. That was a weird place for it to end up. <laughs> that sounds like Rouge. You know what they say, yeah, Rouge, she's sexy, but it's cool. <laughs> oh, wait, that's actually not what the lyrics say. Alright! Oh! Dante has 666 batting average, eh? Okay, let's go! Let's hit a grounder with Dante. Get it away from the catcher a bit. It's a slide, it's a slide, it's a slide, it's a slide. I still don't really know what the open, squared, and closed mean, but eh. Oh, darn it. I did break the preschool toy stream, didn't I? Probably, yeah. Maybe I have to bleep that out in the, uh... Whoops. And this was after the big lecture I gave everybody on the first stream, where I'm like, make sure you keep it PG-rated. <laughs> I'm not sure if Pete should have been safe there, but okay. <laughs> Alright, Mikey, another home run, please. Oh, that's a foul. No, don't catch it. No, Mikey. No, Mikey. No one breaks their leg like Gaston. <laughs> All right, Pablo. Pablo, Pablo only has a .5 batting average. I think Lisa Crockett has a higher batting average than him. That's that's not right. <laughs> that is not right. Oh, they, they're like, Pete is not stealing home. On the edge. Which I was debating doing if they hadn't and done that. Alright, Pablo. Even if you just get a single, Marky Dubois, Crazy Bun. Into it's gonna be funny. <laughs> Stop trying to hit my best players in the face. This is not okay. Oh, are they, are they walking Pablo? Not a bad idea, honestly. But they don't even realize I have a crazy butt. No! Pablo, why are they running away from it? Again, they were just giving me false hope! 
Right. The pitcher ran away just to be like, oh, you're gonna go to, you're gonna get a, for, go to first. Okay, that'll bring up Barky and Boy. And there are runners at second and third. I do not know what Pablo just said. All right, it's time for Freeze to get crazy. <laughs> He almost grabbed it immediately. That's an easy double for Marky! Yeehaw! Oh my gosh. I'm debating going to third, but no. Actually, nobody's at third. <laughs> so. <laughs> Yeehaw! Triple with Marky and Dubois! <laughs> we had to use cheat codes for it, but it's okay. Oh, Master Tony! Oh, we have another one! Not gonna use it. I'm gonna save it for next inning. How is Esther Travolta not gassed? 68 pitches in a row, and she has thrown several special pitches. And she's only struck out, like, one of my guys. So there's no way she got a juice box. Whoa! Tony! Oh no, don't catch it! Come on! My guys can run the opposite way, and there's no... Caught, uh. Darn it, I'm always blown away by Tony's power, but I was just like, oh, they immediately catch it. Rats! Well fine, I'll keep Lisa on the mountain too then. A bouncing ball. Got it. it to first. Oh my gosh, it's good to have a pitcher who has a good arm. That's <laughs> why Tony's probably getting ditched after the Star Wars trilogy's over. Yeah, my guess is Tony will get ditched next season and Angela will replace him. So that way it's the new Star Wars trilogy. No, no promises, but that's kind of my current plan. Get out. They, they just really did not want me to... Get a double play. Oh my gosh, I keep forgetting about... <laughs> I always forget you can move your fielders around before they bat. <laughs> I literally never, ever, ever do it. My goodness, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, we can move everyone in. I always forget about that. <laughs> Wait, did that even do anything? That literally just seemed like everybody... I think that's part of the problem. Even when I use it, it's like, oh, everyone just moves away from where the ball ends up getting hit. Oh, you can move them at diagonals, too. That's that's very interesting. I'll try experimenting with this a bit. Get out! <laughs> Why do these three always appear in a row? Oh, yeah, it's because of Tony. Okay, Arthur. Last chance to redeem yourself today. Own power. I'm not crazy bunting unless someone's on base, or unless I have two outs. <laughs> That's just how it going be. <laughs> Cause I believe we can. Okay, they walk him. <laughs> I'll take the win. <laughs> do, do, do. Every day when you're walking down the street. You call that entertainment? <laughs> it's not entertaining, but it's practical. I could go for the crazy bunt. But I won't. She's set and delivered. That was ball one. Let's do this like prudent. Oh no, wait, what? She magically got a better arm. No! She magically got a better arm just to get Arthur out. What the heck? That's so not fair. <laughs> exactly! <laughs> she did not have that good of an arm until now. That's... <laughs> what the butts. Are they gonna walk Stephanie? I'll take it. Stephanie has been very disappointing at the bat in this game. Or just in general. Yeah, they walked her. Okay. Thanks! Rats. I should have just 
kept Arfur there. I shouldn't have gotten greedy of the steal. I, Arfur's almost maxed at running, though, so I figured he could do it. Obvious time for the crazy bunt. I'm gonna put some dirt in my eyes. Come on, move more. Go home, Steph. Go home, Steph. Oh, Lisa's very slow, but that's okay. Oh, yeah. Dang, yeah. All of their characters have really good arms. Which makes stealing difficult. I think I'm gonna have to go for power. I haven't... Well, change of plans. They should not be giving me this many crazy bunts. That's ridiculous. Guess what Dante's gonna do? And then Mikey Thomas can get a Grand Slam. <laughs> P. But that was like a perfect bunt. Pete, stop following with bunt. How do you even foul with a bunt? Okay, Pete. Pete, <laughs> we don't have time for this growing around. We got, we got, we got a game to win. I know we're five points up, but. Yeah, I've definitely. There are some characters that just naturally follow the ball way easier than others. Like Pablo, almost never fouls it. Pete and Marky foul it a lot. So does Dante. There we go. Yoink! You thought Lisa was going to advance to third with how tired she is? I don't think so. Now this could backfire, because if we foul with the crazy bunt, then we we in trouble. I might... If we foul with the crazy bunt, I actually might just force the strike out. Or I would force the walk, too. That could be fun. Wow! Fat Walt... Fat... <laughs> I almost said Fat Walt Weasley. Fat Ron Weasley. No! Dante, you and your stupid razzle frazzin massive bunt delay to lag delay! Why does he have like a full second of lag before he actually bunts? That's fine. You know what? We can strike out. Mikey Thomas is still here. I know he's gotten out a couple times, but he also got a home run. He still got a cold, but it's okay. I'm gonna get a baby. Yeah, you are. Which means you're gonna get a home run, because there's no other way. No! That's out. Lisa's out. Well, so is Mikey, because, wow, look at how slow he is. What?! Wait, no, no, go back, go back! <laughs> How did we get through that? <laughs> I wouldn't want to meet this kid in a dark alley. I wouldn't want to meet him in a light alley either. The pieces are in place. Uh, now what we have to do is get a grand slam. Okay, not a grand slam. Ground ball up the first baseline. That's a slow nope, that's an out. Man, Pablo! You were kind of disappointing this game. How is it that Pablo did better last game when he had a batting decrease? That's fine. We're five points up. We can, we got this. Come on, Mad Dog. Show her what's what. Oh, now you hit it on the roof of Ernie Steele's house. Gotta love... <laughs> I still love how Ernie Steele's not on the team, but his home field still keeps getting used. He's like, I've, ne I've never been on the baseball team, but I've always been <laughs> chosen for my yard to be a home field. <laughs> Ernie Steele has the best backyard. That's why. Just get her out. Come on. That's what you think, but Tony's catching this. Aha! Take that! Mark is up. One 
You ready to get struck out again, Ron Weasley? <laughs> Red hair and a hand-me-down bat. You must be a Weasley. <laughs> now watch as he pulls off a massive home run. Oh, that's right. Her slow ball will leave something to be desired. Okay, well then maybe we should have your granny join the team, Marky. <laughs> I should have picked Marky's grandma instead of him. Because apparently, their guy was. He got struck out again. Wow. Those two have come up against one another many times. It's always a fierce fight. He's not wrong. I love how that pro player was maxed at batting and Marky was like, My granny couldn't even swap flies hard in that. Marky's grandma is just absolutely cut. Alright, if we get out Ken Griffey Jr., we win the game. It's that simple. Oh, yeah, it is! Drink! Oh, wow! That was a good hit. You're good, but I'm better! That was a short game. That only took an hour. The fishes have crushed them by zero. Boy, are these kids excited. What a game. Tonight at the victory party, it's rumored that Ahmed and some of his cousins are going to bring out their instruments and rock out. Despite that, the party should be a lot of fun. The rest from Shield Stadium... <laughs> but Ahmed's not on the team anymore. Woo! Alright, five to zero. Not as much of a slaughter as last game, but we didn't let them score even once. And we got a Mikey Thomas home run, so I'd say, all in all, pretty solid game. Let's see what they ever do. Oh my gosh, the Indians won 18-2? to That's nuts! Oh my, okay, gotta watch out for the Indians, then. Yikes. Alright. <laughs> Next time, we face the Reds. If they're not the color blue, I will be very disappointed. It'll be another away game, alright. Oh, we've won. Oh, yes, we're undefeated in our league. That's great. So are the Wombats, and the Orioles, and the Indians, and the Mariners, and the Mets. Okay. All right. We're best in our division. That's great. Everyone else has been defeated at least once. All right. Dane. Yeah, we're not even close to being top for home runs anymore. Lindsay Felgate is doing pretty well. Oh, she's on the Indians. That's why. Haha. <laughs> Pete, Mikey, and Dante still the most for hits. Lisa Crockett has two doubles now. Somehow. I don't know how. Marky Dubois is second for triples! <laughs> That's just ridiculous. Pablo and Mikey. Oh, we, we gotta we gotta beat Lindsay Felgate, man. She's doing well. She's she's dominating in all these categories. What the heck? Uh-oh. We got Amir Khan as well, but Pete Wheeler's the only one who still has a 1.0 batting average. Oh, this is good. Pete and Dante with the most steals still, obviously. Lisa Crockett's now number two for strikeouts, which is great. I like that. Kimmy Ekman, with, <laughs> she's not earned any runs. Wonder why. I hope we go up against Kimmy Ekman. That would be funny.